In this short video, I'm going to explain how you can find your HubSpot tracking code and how you can use it to start tracking your visitors. So when you are in your HubSpot account, you're going to go to settings here. So on the left hand side here, you're going to go to tracking and analytics. From there, you're going to click on tracking code. And then this is your tracking code. So what you want to do is just copy this code and place the code on your website. So for example, if I am using Webflow, so if I wanted to place the tracking code on one of my websites, so I can open up my website settings and then go to custom code. And then from here, I can paste that code into the footer because HubSpot recommends that you place the code right before the closing body tag, which means that you want to place the code in the footer because you see here, closing body tag. Click on save changes. And now before we dive into the rest of the video, we like to thank our video sponsor, CartFuel. CartFuel is the easiest and quickest way for you to accept one-time and recurring payments in HubSpot. All you need to do is connect your Stripe or PayPal account, configure your payment form by adding countdown timers, coupons, or order bumps, then copy and paste the code they provide you onto any site, including WordPress or HubSpot pages. Did we mention CartFuel has one-click upsells? That that's right, your customers can order more products without having to re-enter their credit or debit card with a single click. But you want to know what's the best part? When a sale occurs with CartFuel, your customer's name, email address, phone number, and products they purchase will teleport into HubSpot. It's like magic. This means you can trigger workflows to boost customer retention and decrease refund rates. All this and more with no custom code needed. Try CartFuel for free for 14 days by clicking the link in the description or comment section of this video. Alright, let's get back to the content. When this page is loaded or this whole entire website is loaded, it is going to track the, the visitors. And this is the same process. It works for WordPress. It's the same process for any other website builder or landing page builder. Um, I'm just showing you Webflow, but the process is the same. You just need to locate where you can place a code in your footer code and then go in here, go to tracking and analytics, tracking code, copy that code and paste that code right before the closing body tag. So that's how you find and use your HubSpot tracking code. If you have any questions, leave those down below. We love to interact with our community. And if you have any ideas about different videos that we can make, leave a comment down below. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that like button so that other people like yourself can see this type of content. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next video.